the icons of WA, both of them. You know, the Marsh name is enormous in Australian cricket, let alone WA, where they're the biggest. I think we all love Sean. He's obviously a Scorchers legend, so and he's an awesome teammate back in WA. I remember the one in Perth because it was built up for days. That's the man of the moment, Sean Marsh. A lot of the focus on him. I think we landed and there was like eight cameras at Perth Airport and all of them followed Sean and the rest of the team no one cared about. We've already been talking about him a lot. I'm sure the crowd are going to be uh, yelling out a little bit as well. And then the front page paper the next day. About Marsh v Marsh and there's the back page <laughs> of the local paper there. It was the seventh over, Mitch waited till the power play was done, smart captaincy to bowl. And then he was running in and the crowd was getting involved and you could see Sean give a little smile. And like that, you never ever see that. So that's when I knew like he's, he's paying attention to all this life. Marsh v Marsh, the crowd are engaged. Sean Craig says, just hold it a minute, just build the tension a bit more. They haven't played a whole lot against each other, so it was good to watch that and it was good to see Sean, you know, get involved a little bit. Sean crowd, very aware of it. Oh, Sean Marsh, too good. Sauce. He actually belted us at the stadium. We won, but Sauce played beautifully. And then obviously Mitch got him out in Geelong. He gets us some treatment from his brother and caught. Well, little bro's got the big bro again. Which was a good move to bring himself on because I don't really like facing Wes. I'm not sure Sean and Mitch would probably like facing off like that against each other. Getting knocked over by your little brother is, would never be fun. You're never going to hear the end of it. And, and Sauce can't come back with anything, can he? Like, He's not going to get a bowl to knock Mitch over, so it can't really go poorly for Mitch in that scenario. So that was a huge battle, you know, like I said, the crowd really got behind it. It was funny and kind of fun to watch as a player, but I know in their own hearts, I reckon, yeah, they would have been racing. I'm going to say Sean, but only because the other few more years, so in a few more years, hopefully, yeah, Mitch is better. That is big! Huge from Mitch Marsh. Short and Mitch, hard to split them, you know, but the love is huge for both of them. I don't like picking sides on, on that sort of stuff. Depends what you want, right? So they're both very different people. If I'm going to a pub for a quiet beer, I'd go with Sospa. If I'm going to a nightclub, I'd go with Mitch. I always like all around us, as I said before, but I've seen enough of Sean Marsh's cover drive and pull shot and everything else he has to know that he's a gun player and we super ability at playing cricket and great fellas as well, which is the way I like to judge teammates.